In this session, we're going to talk about investment and what it means to invest in people's lives as a small group leader. Investing in lives and investing as a small group leader is one of the wisest decisions you can make. There are three commitments that we must make in order to watch our investment pay off as a small group leader. The first thing is this, we must learn to be committed to a person. What does this mean? People are what we're about. We're about people. We're about watching people grow. We need to be committed to people. We need to be committed to a, the person in front of you. That's what we're committed to. That's what small group leading is all about. You're leading people. You're not leading objects. You're leading people. So we got to keep that in mind that these are people and we're going to invest in their life by ministering to them and being what God has called us to be. The second thing is this. We must be committed to a process. Um, there's a process in everything. Everything has a process. Any kind of growth has a process. And people growing in their relationship with Christ is a process. You accept Christ, you live for Christ, you read the Word, you pray, you grow, and as Paul talked about, you get off the milk and onto the meat. From the milk to the meat is a process. It's something that you have to be committed to. Are you committed to the process of watching someone go for eight weeks or 10 weeks or however long your small group is from week one to week eight to week 10 to week 12, whatever it is, are you committed to that process it's going to take to get them from where they were to where they need to be? Are you committed? That's what it is. The third thing, we must be committed to a purpose. Matthew 28, 19, go make disciples. We're about making disciples. That's what Jesus was about. That's what we're about. Here at Bethel, we want to see people discipled in the Word. We want to see people grow in their relationship with Christ. Be committed to that purpose. The purpose for us right now is to watch people grow in their faith and to take them to the next level, take them to levels they've never been before. That's what our purpose is. So I want to encourage you to be committed to that purpose.